actually take a ride over to the Tropical Tattoo, about eight miles away. They got some kind of chopper show over there. It is pretty busy today here by Destination Daytona. Geez, it's over here, but it looks super crowded. What's up, guys? We're here at Tropical Tattoo right here. Look at that. We got a chopper show. Amazing. So many people. What's up, sweetie? How are you? How you oh, doing? I'm sweaty already. How's everything? Good. Where's everybody else? Um, oh, there he is. <laughs> What's up, bud? How you doing, okay, my man? How you, you doing? Fun. Pleasure meeting you. You as well, man. What's going on? Uh, we gotta go say hi to my boy, Pro Monkey. No YouTubing over here. Hey, how you doing, man? <laughs> how you doing? How was What's the up, ride? brother? How you doing? Good, man. Yeah. Yeah. How you guys doing? Me, hey, uh, how you doing? John, how are you? Yeah, Pops, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. Hey, uh, <laughs> Thanks for your service. You. Not gonna tell you in person. <laughs> What's up, bud? We left in time to be here at like 10:30. Right. Buddy's bike broke, like five oh, miles from the campground. Really? Fixed it, loaded the truck, go back. Da, 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 da. So oh, we're uh, wow. yeah, it's we're we were late. 
So my my choppers. Oh, you have it here. Oh, it's oh, here. Okay, cool. But it's cool. way that way. Yeah, it's crowded. Yeah. It's man. It's packed. It's in the yard. It's packed. Yeah, it's. it's I've never it seen is. It when I bad. tell you it's packed, it's packed, especially it in bad. there. Yeah. No room in there. I don't know I how he's shut, gonna get it in. I have to shut the petcock off on mine at red lights because of all the flows of gasoline. Oh, all about all <laughs> hey, traveling tall copied us. He got the same bike. Yes. <laughs> I saw him yesterday, <laughs> I see you bought my bike. So, Peace, brother. See. All right, man. Be good, man. Yeah, you too. Tell your wife I said hi. Tell your wife I said hi. Thank you. She'll be here tomorrow. All right. Alright guys, too crowded for me, but amazing, amazing choppers, all sorts of kinds, when I tell you. Uh, she rides moto, check her out on Instagram and uh, YouTube, and obviously Weston Customs, check him out on YouTube. I'll leave you guys a link down below in the description, and also, uh, obviously, check out Pro Monkey, excellent content. And he actually has his chopper in the uh, show, so it was in the back. I didn't see it, just way, way too many people. And this spot, obviously, that I have here is fantastic under the shade. I think I'm gonna take a ride down to the beach now and show you guys the beach area. We'll pop the drone up a little bit, get some of that ocean breeze. Thing is wicked looking. I'm gonna head towards the beach, see what kind of view we could get. Yeah, that chopper shell, wow, so many choppers, crazy. Look. This beautiful view. We'll stop right here. Perfect spot. Halifax River and the ocean, right? Right there, a gentleman on his road glide, name is Scott, he lives in Florida, just told me, I'm not kidding you, that there's going to be a NASA or a SpaceX rocket launch in 22 minutes. I'm waiting, I'm not going anywhere, I was just about to leave. I'm gonna see my first ever rocket launch. I think they're launching a satellite up into space. 
Holy cow, let's check this out. Yeah, look. Oh, you got it? Look, there's like a countdown timer. Oh, good, 22 good. minutes, thank yeah. you. Yeah. Appreciate you guys. Hey, Scott, I just went to the NASA website, I guess, and, it, and there's a countdown timer. <laughs> Excellent, that's it. Thank you, sir, appreciate it, thank you. 21 minutes. <laughs> 20, 21 minutes, 50 seconds. Oh, right. oh wow, really? <laughs> yeah, I, I went to the, I guess, to the NASA website, and they show, a, a, like, a countdown. A countdown? Countdown, yeah. yeah. Right. Any idea which direction? Okay. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thanks. That is awesome. Holy cow. I'm so excited. I'm like a little kid. Never seen a damn friggin' rocket launch. This is crazy. I wonder if we could hear it. Holy cow. Obviously, you see them on TV, but look at this pelican. Look at that thing. Massive. It's like a six, seven foot wingspan. What's he doing? Oh! I'm gonna get my drone set up actually. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it towards that way. Maybe we could get a close-up. Let's see. Again, he swooped down. Alright guys, I got my drone. Look at the timer. Nine minutes, six seconds to launch. So Scott over there told me, so I just looked it up. It's a SpaceX Falcon 9 OneWeb 3 uh, rocket bringing up some satellites into space. And I can't believe I'm at the right moment at the right damn time. Holy cow. So I'm gonna try to pop the drone up. Obviously, I'm not gonna go anywhere near it. It's miles away. But um, I'm gonna try to get close and put the drone on Zoom so this way, you know, we'll get the best footage because I don't have any telephoto lens with me. But well, hopefully we'll see and feel it, but I just can't believe I'm here at this right perfect time. I mean, can you believe it? We got eight minutes, 15 seconds, guys. All right, guys, so I got the drone up and I'm flying it like down Halifax River right now. Uh, just get it a little closer to, I guess, uh, Kennedy Space Center. And, um, and then I'm just going to try to zoom it in. I'm going to zoom on the camera on the drone to get you guys, try to get you guys the best footage. So as you guys, hopefully you guys could see that. I'm not sure, but... Um, the drone is overlooking the Atlantic Ocean. You got Halifax River right there and a strip of land. And rocket's going to be taken off somewhere there. And let me show you here. Right there, it says T minus three minutes, 55 seconds. <laughs> and the reason why I'm really excited because I'm ex Air Force. If you guys didn't know that, I love anything aeronautical, space, astronomy. I uh, really, you really can't see it. It's right there. Let me see if I can see it with my drone. Yeah, it, it took off early, but you could see it right there, the contrail, and now I can still see it. Amazing, but you can see the contrail right there. Let me put it on. See right there, you can see the contrail, but it's gone. Holy cow. I, I don't think, yeah, the camera's not going to do it justice, but I could still see the contrail. I don't know if you guys can. And it's gone. Wow, that was quick. Jeez, that was quick. 
Holy cow. Well, I'll tell you, it was, it was amazing and a little disappointing all at the same time because uh, the, the countdown, it was definitely off. It still said about 20 seconds and the thing was already thousands of feet in the air. Um, you can't even hear it, but uh, I'm, sh it's, I'm sure it's loud as hell, but uh, it's just really far away. I just got a glimpse of the contrail, but then with, I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up, but with the naked eye, you could see the rocket, like I seen the rocket go up. It's amazing, pretty cool. That was pretty, pretty wicked. But I was too busy looking down because the countdown timer still said like 20, 15, 20 seconds. So I was too busy looking down and getting everything ready and stuff. And then people are like, hey, it's up, it's up, it's up. You see the contrail, and then you see the big like, it's like almost like a rust color uh, from the fuel tanks. Um, you know, you could see that. You can't see obviously the capsule where uh, where I guess they hold everything, the white capsule um, or the main spacecraft, but you could definitely see uh, the rusted or I, I'm just saying rust colored tanks. I don't know if that it, that's, I'm sure that's not the case, but whatever the color that I, I guess it's paint or something, whatever, but that's what I could see. So now we're gonna go grab Sunny Eat because I haven't ate since, um, I don't know, about six o'clock this morning, 6 a.m. I'm gonna meet Rob over at the uh, over at the Longhorn. We're gonna grab something to eat and then just relax for a bit because then we gotta meet uh, everybody from Rurock over at uh, Blockhead's Garage. So stay tuned, guys. Yeah.